So in this video, we're going to cover how you would replace the cabin air filter in your BRZ FRS or GT86. But Tyler, I hear you ask, why would I ever need to change my cabin air filter? Simply because you don't want to breathe in heinous ass air. Replacing the cabin air filter will also improve your weak AC flow, and if your car smells like old balls when you cut the air on, it might be the air filter. You know, not filtering the air. And the insulation process is super simple. All we need is a pair of pliers and a new filter. So here we are on the passenger side of the car. First thing we want to do is go ahead and just open up the glove box. And on the right hand of the glove box, we're going to find this little strut. We want to use the pliers to kind of pinch these two together. As you can see, it's kind of slit. That'll allow you to pop this strut off. Perfect. So after we use the pliers to kind of get this strut off, now we just need to push in the sides. And you'll see these little wings kind of come out. And we'll do it for both sides. There we go. And now the glove box should fall out. Cool. So now with the glove box out of the way, we now have access to the compartment where the cabin air filter is stored. Now we just need to simply open the door and there's our air filter. So we can just slide this out. Oh yeah, ooh, hey, take a look at that. So here's the new filter, obviously compared to the old filter. As you can see, this one's kind of black, has a ton of nasty stuff in between the grooves. So obviously we don't want to be breathing the air through that. We want to get this nice clean one in. So it's basically just the reversal of the removal. Go ahead and get the new one, get this slapped in. One thing to note with the filter is they are directional. So you want to ensure that you're installing it the proper way. So you can go ahead and just slide the new one in. Just want to close the door. And we can reconnect the tab. Like so, and then just kind of force that back in. So now we just want to take our little strut and get this guy pushed back on there. And there you go, the uh, cabin air filter has now been replaced and now you're breathing clean air for once. So there we go, that's how we'd replace the cabin air filter in your BRZ FRS or GT86. As we saw, super simple process, only need a pair of pliers to kind of pull that off and slide the uh, new filter in. If you guys have any issues, comments, or questions, go ahead and leave them down below and I'll do everything I can to help you out. And as always, I thank each and every single one of you for watching. And if you'd like to subscribe for more mediocre content such as this, please do and take care.